The Holly Tree by Robert Salvi, read for LibriVox.org by Amanda Chandler. O reader, hast thou ever stood to see the holly tree? The eye that contemplates it well perceives its glossy leaves ordered by an intelligence so wise as might confound the atheist sophistries. Below a circling fence, its leaves are seen wrinkled and keen. No grazing cattle through their prickly round can reach to wound. But as they grow where nothing is to fear, smooth and unarmed, the pointless leaves appear. I love to view these things with curious eyes and moralize, and in this wisdom of the holly tree can emblems see wherewith, perchance, to make a pleasant rhyme, one which may profit in the aftertime. Thus, though abroad, perchance, I might appear harsh and austere, to those who on my leisure would intrude, reserved and rude. Gentle at home amid my friends I'd be, like the high leaves upon the holly tree. And should my youth, as youth is apt, I know, some harshness show, all vain asperities I, day by day, would wear away, till the smooth temper of my age should be like the high leaves upon the holly tree. And as when all the summer trees are seen so bright and green, the holly leaves their fadeless hues display, less bright than they. But when the bare and wintry woods we see, what then so cheerful as the holly tree? So, serious should my youth appear among the thoughtless throng, so would I seem, amid the young and gay, more grave than they, that in my age as cheerful I might be as the green winter of the holly tree. End of poem.